so a lot of purple vibe is going on at the background my nail up and her eyes are eyes are beautiful you guys i can just sit and stare at this all day long hi you guys and welcome back to my channel my pastel love hi i'm neha how you guys doing i hope you all are well so today's video is very exciting for me because i'm going to try out some new makeup and it's my one of my favorite brands so are you guys ready because i am so as i've read in the title today i'm going to talk to you guys about a few huda beauty products which has recently launched in india and i've been eyeing it for a long time and as soon as it launched i decided to get it and i'm just going to show you guys how i created this look with these products and what are my thoughts in it so let's get to that so the first product that i've got from huda beauty is their mercury retrograde palette i'm like this is so stunning i mean i love huda beauty palettes like i have all of their palettes like all of their uh, bigger palettes many of their smaller palettes so if you want to see my eyeshadow palette collection or my huda beauty eyeshadow palette collection and my thoughts on it do let me know in the comment section below i'll do it coming back to this palette this is such a beautiful palette you guys i mean Huda Beauty palettes are beautiful but let's just talk about the packaging first so this is how it looks like it's a beautiful packaging like like a plasticky holographic packaging with a lot of purple vibe going on which is why i thought let me make the whole vibe little purple so yeah that is that so inside you get like 18 eyeshadows and the theme you know the color theme is so unique and so beautiful it's very purpley yet pinky and then you have a pop of blue here i mean it's super duper duper exciting for me so i'm just going to talk to you guys about this palette a little bit they have their traditional nine eyeshadow nine matte buttery eyeshadows and their matte eyeshadows guys are beautiful it's buttery it's pigmented it blends well i mean if you did not use any i any huda beauty eyeshadow palette i suggest you go and try at least one of the palettes to understand the formula the their formula are beautiful like Oh my god. And another thing I like about this palette, actually not this palette. I like about all Huda Beauty palette is that in within one palette they have a lot of different formulas going on. Like even in this one like I just read it out what all they have like I think five different um uh, formulas of eyeshadow palette in one particular palette. So they have nine buttery mattes, the traditional buttery mind blowing matte eyeshadows and they have six high shine creamy metallics. They have one glitter powder like this one, the shade Nebula. That's my favorite shade. Oh my god, it's such a beautiful glitter. I mean it's beautiful. And they have two sheer multi reflective shadows. They have got like four different type of formulas within one palette. Isn't that exciting? And I just love Huda you guys. I mean all this I bought with my own money. Of course it's not sponsored. I bought it on Nykaa and I I just love eyeshadow palettes. It's my thing. But yeah, and I just love Huda and I've been following her for years like since uh, before she took out her brand, you know, before it got hyped. I used to watch her as a vlogger, like as a YouTuber, I used to follow her, just love her. And I'm so glad she comes out with this amazing palette. All right. So this particular palette retails for rupees 5375 rupees. I know, I know it's supremely expensive for one eyeshadow palette, but Huda Beauty as a brand is a high end expensive brand. I know it's very supremely expensive. That's what even I felt at first. But the thing is guys, the quality, the quality is so good that I feel that it's a uh, it's worth every penny because you are getting what you pay for and i feel like that is something makeup in general is expensive and there are high end brands and there are like mid middle range and there are like 
uh, your drugstore or affordable brands which is great but uh, even in high end brands there are hits and misses and Huda Beauty actually never fails to surprise me and it's always up there like if i'm if i'm paying for a Huda palette no i'm going to get good quality so i blindly just go for it because i have all her rest of her palettes and everything so i just love her product i love her lipsticks i love her eyeshadow palettes i love her uh, liner foundation everything so yeah that's out of the question so the expiry date batch number everything and all the detail is written at the back i got this from nika and when i received it it had come with one shade broken like i, I it breaks my heart when you're paying like 5000 rupees and you get a damaged product like in transition it got uh, damaged so that breaks my heart but i did not think of replacing it i could have but i uh, but because it was just one shade one shadow like that to one matte this, this light uh, color which i'm going to use hardly so i was like okay but any other shade would have been broken like any of the shimmers or any of other colorful mattes would be broken i would definitely ask for a replacement but um, because it was this one shade which is a light lighter shade which I'm going to use maybe in my inner corner and brow bone I was like okay I know today's look is supremely like loud but it's okay it's makeup you gotta have fun with colors once in a while and when you have palettes and color stories like this you don't want to do boring looks so I'll just show you guys how I got this look. For that you gotta come up close and personal. First I'm going to show you guys the swatches. So this is the swatches of the first two rows right here. It looks so good. And this is the swatch of the second row. Starting with these two shades right out there. I'm going to take a fluffy brush. This is an Anastasia brush and I'm going to start buffing it onto my crease, blowing it out and very roughly just, this is going to be like my transition shade. Next taking the darker mauve shade, I'm just going to dab off the excess and taking the same brush, I'm going to apply this into the outer corner and I'm going to spread it all over my crease, blending it with the crease shade. Next I'm going to take this darker mauve shade and it's the same brush just the other end of it and I'm going to very carefully place it onto my outer corner and blend it very nicely. And the thing with these shades is that it blends very well. Next I'm going to take this beautiful blue shade and start applying it onto my lower lash line just playing having some fun with colors it's a beautiful color you guys taking that nebula shimmer shade onto my brush i'm going to start applying onto my lids but i kind of feel like fingers work best with such shadows so i'm just going to take my finger and place it onto my lids and look at that it just looks so beautiful the shape Next, taking the Lacme Gelato Eye Pencil in the shade Lagoon, I'm going to put that onto my lower waterline and it gels so well with the blue shadow. Next, taking the Huda Beauty Life Liner, I'm going to take the liquid liner side and, and start drawing a wing sort of a line. I'm so bad at doing this, especially on camera, so, I'll, so just bear with me you guys. Next I'm just going to put on some mascara, this is the Smashbox mascara and some falsies. Then taking that lighter shade I'm going to place that onto my brow bones and inner corner for some highlighting. And that's the finished look, I think it looks pretty good. 
next uh, so the next product that i've got from this is this nude medium palette this is like the nine uh, pan palettes this is how it looks like again this is beautiful you guys this is so 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 this is so like the color theme is so wearable so warm so nude and uh, this is like an everyday palette so if you actually ask me which one should you get like this or this uh, first of all this is uh, less expensive uh, it's for 2500 rupees uh, for nine eyeshadows um, so if you are a person who is not very into experimentation with colors and you just don't like wearing too much of uh, colorful eyeshadows or jhatta cloaks and now you don't like then i think you should go for this one because this has your everyday shades and you can use it it's nude it, you cannot go wrong with this right and if you are somebody who loves to play with colors and wants to experiment with a huda beauty palette i would definitely suggest you to go for this one okay now coming back to this again look at the packaging i mean can you guys see that it's such a beautiful packaging i love huda's packaging it's like a foxy leather it's not real leather but looks and feels like leather with like an animal print on it and the uh, and nude is written here and this is in the shade medium that's also printed here and huda's uh and huda beauty is written here so you have got the right things imprinted on it such a beautiful <laughs> this just sitting alone in the vanity looks so good uh, so again this is like a collector's item the packaging is so good uh, so next item that i've got from them is this beautiful looking eyeliner so it's uh, like dual ended so one side is your traditional black uh, liner that you have liquid liner and one side is like a kajal so it's like a two in one thing like a lot of times what happens is after you have done your eyeliner you still have to fill in uh, the little gaps and all that are left right so for that again you need to go to some other product and do that so for this this is like a two-in-one you can use this and you're good to go and guys this is one of the richest blackest long lasting eyeliners out there this retails for rupees 2050 rupees again i know it's expensive but but you're getting like a two-in-one product and it's an expensive band as i told you so uh i think it's worth it like if the quality is there it's worth every penny you guys because this is one of the most richest darkest blackest long lasting eyeliners out there my final verdict on this is that are these worth it according to me yes it's worth every penny because the quality is there it looks beautiful and if you are a makeup junkie like me you should definitely get your hands on these so it's it's up to you it's your decision and yeah thanks for watching you guys i hope you liked this video if you did don't forget to hit the like button don't forget to hit the subscribe button and yeah just join the pastel family you guys you guys mean a lot to me and leave a comment down below so that i know what you guys feel about this video and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video till then take care bye bye love you all